kind of like how the clock spins. See through the table, apparently. I see you. I, I like how he actually looks over the to, 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 to the door because apparently he's just talking to whatever. Uh, I'm a FBI ninja. <laughs> oh, look at the E. Look at that. I see how it's yeah. flickering. Yeah, I'm not sure if that's. I'm pretty sure that's not intentional. Yeah. Maybe it has to do something with the brain. I don't know. No idea. It, it's like a you know a hacker and like um. Dead by daylight. Go for the locker. <sighs> Garbage. Garbage. Oh? see you and they proceed to go to the other side of the room. Come on dude, yeah you're <sighs> I'm pretty sure we have to run, okay? No, I don't think so because I'm pretty sure that, that red bit just opened behind the counter. <sighs> no, no animation for like gasping for breath. Get your axe back. Uh, what? <laughs> what? This axe clipped through the, through the door for us. Okay, so going into lockers, like, really messes with our stamina, huh? Dude, there was a red thing behind you. <sighs> oh, it's gone now. Zach, this is a waste of time. Let's go. No, there was a red circle. Like, oh. like you know, like a, a story progressing circle. Where I'm not crazy. I'm not. There, there's like a hide, like. I don't know. Oh, what? Inside the oven? Is that what it's asking you to hide? Okay, no, never mind. Uh -huh. Okay, then. if the audio was still working. All oh, the dead enemies, was that it? Like, maybe, like, all these, like, pipes and stuff were just... Wait! 
Does it load the whole level in? Like everything? Mm. Is there no like a occlusion calling? Well, there's occlusion calling. I mean, that's that's a rendering thing, but it might hold on to. Uh, oh, hello. Hey, man. Why? Why A and D to run? What? What is this? What is this? Bruh. His camera is uh, a little buggy. What is this? Why do I have to push this? Why is he stopping? Okay, thanks, dude. <laughs> thanks, bro. <laughs> Is this why the pipes were here? Uh, Wait, what? Dude, get out here! Yo, what? Why, why is he force choking us? Why can't they see anything? Quick, quick! Why, why is he uh, force choking us? Do the nuh uh uh! Do the nuh uh uh! Do the nuh uh uh! <laughs> why, why did everything like go I pink? don't know. Bruh. He just stops there. No, no. So slow when opening what, the door. What the heck? He just turned around like he did like a quick 360. Yeah, let me wait till he gets to the door first. Uh oh. No, wait, What's wait, happening? wait, wait, What's happening? What's happening? <laughs> why, why is everything everything purple again? I don't know. No, uh uh. Uh uh. Uh. What? What, what was that? And he just goes through it. And also his eyes are clipping through the back of his neck. <laughs> <laughs> no, look, he just like, passes through the middle. <laughs> now the vines are helping us, question mark? No, I think this is just like... The trap. Yeah, this is like... We're just backtracking. Yeah, well, we have, we have to, to, to like, do the thing first. So. He's gonna be, appear behind us or in front of us. I was gonna say he's gonna appear behind the door, but that didn't happen. Oh, yeah, the tree. Why am I here behind there again? Uh, oh, is there another door here besides that one? No. Oh, no, no. Wait, but how did we. Red is like, what is the red? I forgot what that means. That's like north. We're there. We want to get to to go to the end of the hallway and then. That's where we just got chased through. Yeah, you're right. That is where we just got chased through. Now we're back here. Oh, do we just like. Also, I wonder if those cutscenes, like the evasion cutscenes, are a way to bypass the uh, stamina of the or Maybe they, it's, it's like inbuilt, and they have to make it a whole cutscene in order for in order for the game to function.
thought so too, but oh well, no, we were going down and the elevator stopped. Um, then we pulled the hair out of the elevator, remember? Oh yeah, isn't this in the, in the sawmill? Where are we going? I don't know. Apparently it's a pretty, uh, pretty, uh, large sawmill. Yeah. We have a submachine gun, why can't we use that on the guy? Hey, come oh. Okay. Oh. oh! Go back up! <laughs> no, uh, uh! <laughs> yeah. I somehow pressed that time. He did not hear us. Yeah. What? Use the mouse? Yeah. I guess so. Back. What? Why? Oh, okay. Well. <laughs> wow. uh, your axe is glitching out a little there, buddy. I didn't realize your axe had like collision with the floor. Just one piece of right part, right, right brain part. Ah, now we have all the other pieces. Oh. Oh, we're back here again. Really? Why did we make it back here? Oh God. Oh no. Zach, I need to think. Forced profiling. Quite sure either. Like the biggest mystery to me is like the reverse keys. I think they she gave them over to them, and then and then they. No, but she did that. That's all the information we need, Zack. Let's go back and show them what we found. He'll explain it all, I think, once we talk to the sheriff, because the sheriff is more like us and doesn't understand the mind of, 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 uh, <laughs> of York. Ah, right, we magically appeared back on the surface. Why are, what, what's going on with the shadows? Why do we have a shadow clipping through our head? I don't know. Man, that took all day. Yeah. Have you seen any of these things before? No, not that I know of. But that raincoat is a little odd. I've never seen a red bear. Odd? In a town where it rains so much? Well, the people here rarely go out in the rain. I moved here during high school, and I never really understood why. Can you shed some light on this, George? No. Oh, well, there's an old story. Folklore. It's a fairy tale to me. Something about a killer in a raincoat who appears on rainy nights. A vicious killer in a bright red raincoat. You know, uh, just a foolish piece of superstition. A rubbish story someone made up. Not many people still believe it, but I guess it's a traditional place. Most of the shops still close up when it rains. School's out, too. What? Okay, that's a little weird. And yeah. Since there's no reason to go out, not many people ever wear raincoats. And and now the raincoat say? killer has leapt out from his picture book. Oh, by the way, would you two kindly show me your bags? Bang! Our bags! Bang. Is this related to the case? person with the upside down peace mark in that photo we found he's our killer then what makes you so sure about that Zach and I saw him kill Anna in the lumber mill he killed her right in there oh one thing please don't ask me about Zach. I had to bring up his, that person that's a thing. private matter of course 
Anyway, by showing me your backs, we can clear up most of my concerns about you. Isn't that for the best? You do want to remove yourselves from the suspect list. It will make things a lot easier. This is insane. Your methods are rude, insulting, and out of the question. And Emily is a female officer. Forcing her to show you her back oh. is harassment. I don't care if you are FBI or not. You are out of line. Mm-hmm. Hmm. George, it's okay. Let's just show him and get it over with. Emily, are you crazy? Look, we flash our backs and he'll start trusting us a little more. Right? He'll ditch you out in front Agent of the car York. so he can pick up brand new cars. That's how this works. Are you satisfied now? Yes. My apologies. Now you, George. Yeah, yeah, okay. I can't refuse it now, can I? But don't expect to get your way all the time, Agent Morgan. I guess that was supposed to be a mark on the back. I, well, yeah, I kind of assumed that in the first place, but like... Huh? George. I mean, he has scars all over his face. So where, where are these scars? Just Don't like ask about Mr. that, Zach. man. Something private. I don't have to tell you about it. Of course. Just like Zach. We can understand that, right, Zach? Don't do it in front of them! <laughs> what are you doing? Anyway, I'm crazy. This will make things a lot easier from now on. I'm glad to say you're both pretty much off the hook. Pretty much. What do you mean, pretty much? Thank you for your cooperation. Yeah, you either trust him completely or you're paranoid If anyone is suspicious around here, it's him. He's the most suspicious. No, I don't think so. But he certainly is the most irritating. We've studied the crime scene. You know what we have to do next, Zach. George. Can we arrange to have the town folk gather in one place? There are some things I want to address with the town folk. Very well. I'll arrange to have as many as possible gather in the community center tomorrow. Thank be you. Late. That's what George. we're going to do. We're good, we're good to be late. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I agree. The collective side. I agree. We restarted the game, remember? Uh, uh, our basic wage on paid salary <laughs> is larger than the payment we we received. What what is that? All within the day? <laughs> Welcome back, everyone. What's uh, this? A Thomas, Agent Morgan. It's past twenty one. What? downright creepy why is that happening the community i don't know why is that just everything obscured in like, started, like darkness i'm exhausted i was just about to suggest the same thing i'll make arrangements for people to gather between 1500 and 70 so we sacrifice for right trying to get as many people as i can to come like, so don't be late of, like, okay are, don't be late sorry. i'll be there uh, the community center's darkness. on the south side i've marked it on your map oh, God. thanks thomas <laughs> well then oh, no. see you tomorrow <laughs> <laughs> no, don't go into the into the shadow. You'll be lost forever. <laughs> what was that face he just made? I don't know. Who is this? Why, why is it like this? Bruh. <laughs> no. Why, what happened? Why is this here? Is this a missionary site? Oh, Moyer's lumber mill. Oh, you. Huh. So you can't. Uh, you, so you can redo it? Is that what it's about? Yeah, I, I think I so. Know. That's cool. Oh, wait. Brand new? It says park. Okay, so it's like a lot back. Oh.
Hey, why is that just all the obscured and shadowed? I don't know. <laughs> what happened? What happened? No. There's a few, a few bro, a few bugs. Just a little. You have to find the lighter on the structure, and like. Oh, but we we're forced it's like a ladder. What the heck? Wait, wait, was that a hole in the fence? Yeah. Oh, I went to the wrong one though. We may have to either replay the mission or do a. Uh, That's what I mean, is like the redo, I think it may not actually be a redo. It might be some other like extension that we can play. And that you get rewarded by it with the trading card for. I don't know. Yeah, I see it's like Yeah, it I see it. Like oh, I it just looks this looks like just a visual artifact. Yeah. Like this whole model? Yeah, this whole model getting painted black. Seems like a visual artifact to me. I don't think there's any game logic involved there. I've seen things like it. Rendering is kind of... The audio being echoed? Yeah, with the door. Not right now. Bash through the fence. Time driving music. Why do you do that whenever he gets it? Why does he do that whenever he gets out of the car? Zach, is there he, like, something here the that engine. you want to check out? Sorry. We need to be at the community center by 1500 today. Just he, like, think of talking in front of all those people. What do you think, Zach? It's going to get fun. Uh, he like revs the engine before he gets out of the car. Just uh, just ju just some hunting going on. That's it. Fall in the lake. Fall in the lake. I don't think they'll let us. Do we need? A, do we need? A, we might need like a fishing pool or something. Well, oh, that's right. You could buy one at the hotel. Remember? Oh. In the hotel lobby. Worm got was like exposed via explosive barrel. That makes perfect sense. sense. Yeah, it makes sense. Makes sense. Yeah. 
Agent Honor for destroying explosive barrels. On pub from public property. Yeah, I was about to say, on public property. <laughs> Again, really cursed. Next 600 miles. There's a train track now, so we can get across that. If you go south farther, I'm pretty sure that's where the town is. Yeah, down follow this road. Oh no, what is that? We are. So it's not down this way, it's not that way, so it must be somewhere this way. Yeah, we have to go this way, I think. I guess we could stop over here. I don't know if they have gas, though. I don't know. Press R? Press uh, Bricked the whole game? I, I, I press side mission. <laughs> oh no. Okay, I guess we have to restart the game. What? That's cringe. Yeah, that's really dumb. Okay, so don't take on side missions that you're not certain will work. Or if there are no side missions, that might be it. Oh, yeah, we can do that. That's good. Hmm. Huh. <sighs> 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 I, I can say with certainty that those are probably bots. Oh, they can Previously control. during the end. I wonder if no, the property of the loading screen has something. To Welcome back. I don't need to. I'll make a rain. Has, has to do something with the, the crashes or like the freezes. I guess freezes and never. Plus, the racing mini games are just. Yeah, they're the flag. Plus, I see, uh... Zack, picking up from where we left off, now Joel Gray's daughter is, of course... That's right, Jennifer Gray. You knew that, right, Zack? Is he alright, right? Jennifer Gray. She's in one of my most favorite movies. Ferris Bueller's Day Off. 1986, directed by John Hughes. Huh, <laughs> that one was so 80s. Zack, you're not the most cheerful guy I know. But you really do like those cheerful movies. We used to love those teenage movies back then, didn't we? Breakfast Club and Pretty in Pink, St. Elmo's Fire, and Fast Times at Ridgemont High. That last one was in 1982, like directed by Amy Heckerling. Yeah, I guess we turn that. Like, unless we can go straight. I don't know if we can. It looks like the railroad tunnel is like. Uh, yeah, I don't really want to get hit by a train. That that train is like really slow. Can there's just. This isn't railroad tracks. Why does it look 
like a railroad track on the map. <laughs> oh, it's because we're doing gas. Cruising, though. How am I using gas if I'm cruising? Economy with four dollars a gallon. <laughs> Come on, man. Show me the verses, ain't right, man. man. Ain't right. Please, man. <laughs> what happens if we run out of gas? Do we gotta walk? Yeah, probably. Yeah, or we get to. Was that person trying to like run me off the road? They were like aiming for my car. Uh, Might as well just go like. Car accident penalty. What are you talking about? Car accident penalty. Wait, does it just re give us new gas, maybe, when we run out? What? Zach, is there something here that you want to check out? We need to be at the community walking. center by 1500 today. We're walking. Just think of talking in front of all those people. No. What do you think, Zach? Terrible. It's going to get fun. No, it won't. Right? Are your people? What is this GTA 5? Well, that's what I was kind of thinking. Like, can I, like, <laughs> you know, ask this guy for his car? We're, we're, we're not going to pull him out at gunpoint, obviously, right? So that's, a to that's a totally Morgan thing to do. Yeah. It's for an investigation. Please step out FBI of the FBI agent, open up. Uh, the name's... Lend me your car. <laughs> York Morgan. People just call me York. <laughs> of course, we could just peek in someone's window and have the car magically respawn next to us. Remember? Yeah, wait, uh... Penalty didn't. So the penalty didn't. Uh... It, it like deducted like twenty two dollars. Yeah, but it didn't give us any like any more gas or anything, right? I'm like a hundred percent not sure, right? If I didn't see it, I'm like. I'd say ninety nine, but that's like a cop out. I'm kind of tired of saying, oh, I, I'm like 99% sure. Entirely certain, but it's like... I, I'm essentially so certain, it, it doesn't matter, like, otherwise. Right? Alright. I, I, well... I don't know. Like, it's only 1% difference. Why is he taking a long way, a long time in like a... Yeah, I just realized if there were a gas station, it'd probably be closed, wouldn't it? Uh, Watch, the car's gonna be summoned. Bruh. Huh? Suspect? And it's closed? I wonder if this is like food. Does it like the, the does the suspect like change every game or uh, how much? Oh wait, I need to check if, if the car got summoned right. I don't think it did. Oh wait, oh, yes it, it did. 
you are correct. It did. Uh, I'm telling you, you're just peeking in the window and let your car get summoned to your location. You are right. All right, let's see if it has gas now. No, it doesn't. Right, look, I get I get deducted when I enter the car. Bro, I guess we have to walk. I don't know what else we can do. It's some garbage. Why are they deducting money if we can't like? That plane, the the GA port. That's it. The Apparently, <laughs> you know, I'd put like maybe one police station in the middle of the fucking place. If I can fire into random cars and get a person. Also, look, the the artifacting went away when I peeked in the window. Yeah, you can hear that. What the hell? Okay, we just waltz into their house. Okay, we can sleep here. Cool. <laughs> Is this this our house? <laughs> what, you think it's gonna look on that? Nobody else here, I mean like... <sighs> It doesn't look like a turkey sandwich. <laughs> it looks like you put like a, an eggplant or like squid in there. What? Wow! What? No way. That's awesome. That was so cool. It crashed after trying to change the scene. Bruh. I hope we didn't just soft walk ourselves. So I might as well save. I wonder if the artifact thing will come back. Previously. It just doesn't tell us. Okay, where do we gotta walk to? Oh, um, we gotta go okay. And then hopefully we'll get a car back? Question mark. Oh, the sheriff's department. Another car there. Okay then. I hope we can sleep up here. Oh, that's not gonna be good.
Okay, so like all the important locations are like either highlighted in red or like highlighted in green. Okay, that's some in the car. Get paid for for some reason. Vehicle, two vehicles. Get around last. Morgan, that's their fee deducted. Because the end of their fee is Wow. Dollars for entering into car yeah. How do we get gas if all cars do this? Well, well, we haven't tried out this car. I hit something. Okay, look, that's clearly marked as a house on on our mini map. Oh wait, no, it's not. It's like a different house. I thought the pink like house was marked as something. Marked in pink. I don't know what that means. What? The top of the map. What? Pink. The house. Yeah, I, I don't know what that means either. We need to sleep somewhere where it won't crash. Or what if we just go there now? And Oh, it'll probably be close, won't it? Yeah, that's true. Okay, Zach. I've been thinking uh, about what movie I'd like to watch next. And finally, I've made a decision. It's always hard to narrow it down just to one movie, but I've put a lot of thought into this, and I'm sure you'll agree with me. 1975, directed by Steven Spielberg himself, the grandfather of panic movies. Hmm? Zach, we'll finish our chat later. Let's take a walk around Sir, here. you interrupt my attempt at pressing the escape button with your conversation. Okay, we just need to eat. Yeah, we're not going to do that because I want some food. Bowen might be dangerous. Got to make sure that I get my gun out. Just kidding. Okay, I wasn't close enough. Bro. Okay, we're being lured in. Hey, well, but the stupid little nails that only give us like five dollars. <laughs> Tell me this isn't on this. This is purely like redwood pine. human bone this doesn't look related to the case but shouldn't i let someone know i think the like i guess the dog was there to show us where the pickup was yeah where a dog 
dragged it there. Something like that. Give me my medals! Yeah, it just disappears off the map. Okay, so it's, it's just a path, it just isn't on the map. <laughs> Anything suspicious. I'm not re voting a gun with broken car. Because of that. If I head back the way we came, though, so we don't lose the car. Uh, I doubt we're going to lose it. Also, look, look the car just teleported back like 15 feet out. How much is the yard again? Because we're making impressive distance. If I remember, like, there's something like 12 feet on the border. Uh, no, the or yard is, is y y a yard is three, three feet. Shadowy figure behind that van. And it's gone. The van is. into something invisible. About the other door? I think that was just like a path to the door we came in. Front door we came in. Yeah, I know. The other door is the back door. Looks like it was opening to outside, unless that's all a scam. Look, we just automatically enter.
This was a troll house. No mortal, no mortal man was supposed to enter it. What the heck? Oh. Huh. 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 Uh, what, what is that? It looked like a giant, like, a uh, dog. dog. Like, hallucinating? What the heck? Yes. Nice shot. Yes. What? What? I, I guess it's just great stuff. Yes. Bullseye. <laughs> Agent Morgan, back at it again, killing giant dogs in the middle of the night. Can <laughs> we just say like, kill the ho hellhound? Uh, uh, so first, it was, uh, what is what is happening here? First it was the zombies, now it's just hellhounds. Dog is gone. What? Dog is gone. It just vanished. Sure. Ah, it's gone. I thought I saw the eyes go back over. What? Okay, okay, I'm crazy. No, it despawned. Scared me for a second. I thought like a man was standing there. What kind of event is this supposed to be? Is this where like you know you're not supposed to go out when it rains? Maybe that's what it means. Yeah. Where cargo? Up. Uh, it was back by the house. How far away? Um, yeah, we went. We went inside. I go down to the sheriff's office. Steal a new car. <laughs> I'm, gonna go, I'm gonna go peek in the window and summon it. I mean, borrow a new car. Yeah. Here we do not have wizard powers. I think you're right. I think this is the, the don't go out in the rain thing. Just have it to rain. Oh, God, let me peek in the window. Happened to the other patrol car. Oh, you mean the the one that huh? was out of gas? Is that what you're talking about? Yeah. I don't know what that was doing. Is it making noise? Oh. Thinking what happens in the way this works is the last vehicle you get you went into is marked as your current active vehicle, and all other vehicles are like garbage collected, so to speak. and frightening. I, I I can't talk right now. We're in the middle of like a. Why are we going this way? Uh, also, I thought I could go through those bushes. This is. Wait, can we turn on our wipers? I forgot how to do that. We won't be able to view the controls unless we're in the start menu. Oh yeah, hey Zach, picking up from where we left off. Okay, Zach, I've been thinking what about what you would like to watch next, oh. and finally oh. I've made a decision. It's always hard oh, to man. narrow it down just to one oh, movie, oh, but I put a lot of thought. What the heck? This, and I'm sure you'll agree with me. Nineteen seventy-five. I'm killing them. They're, they're just like going into oh, why is the car down himself. to sixty-nine percent? The grandfather of Penny. We ran into a bunch of got dogs. I guess. Oh, those are zombies. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I guess it's stay away just don't, 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 years. don't go out when they, it rains. I was they, they spawn that in front of you. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about, right? Yeah? It's Jaws. The underwater camera work accompanied by that John Williams music. I'd never been that scared by a movie before. But the best thing I'm about it is that it isn't Jaws. just another panic movie. The mayor who won't close the beach even when there are so many victims. Chief Brody putting the citizens' lives above all else. Gonna turn to 15 a.m. Exactly. We're, we're going to be safe. Let's continue our chat later.
Zach, Emily arranged for people to come. Come on, don't do this, sir. Hundred and seventeen hundred. We can't do anything here right now. What are you talking Let's about? Look, at the right look time. above you. Let me in. Okay. Oh. Yo. Why did park the car all the way over there? The hallucinations. <laughs> the hallucinations. We are not mentally stable here. No, I think we just have to sleep. We have to sleep and wait. Where? I don't know. Uh, we could do it at the house we slept at earlier. Or we could do it... Um, I guess that's what we'll have to do. I'm gonna wreck the car. Yeah, it's gonna be destroyed by the time we're done. Wait, what do you mean, don't be late? Wait, we've been early every yeah, single we have time. we've never been late. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh bruh. Bruh. Oh, bruh. Don't worry, I'm a good driver. <laughs> I, I, always can, I can save us out of a flip like that. Sorry, go ahead. I, I always land on my tires. Is it twenty five percent? I don't think it's gonna make it. <laughs> no, wait, 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 wait! This is all misunderstanding. No, get out of here! <laughs> I can't even do damage to you when you're charging at me like that, and you can't. I don't think you can damage me. Thing in the sky. It's. <laughs> uh, no, I don't think so, but. It's just a folk tale. It's it, it's it's idle talk. Okay, buddy, tell that to all the zombies and the hellhounds that are like attacking not, my house. Not like, do they not wake up in the middle of the yeah. night to get like food or something? And they like look outside their window and there's like sixteen zombies just out there in yeah. the rain. But do these people even have like a graveyard? I don't even know if they're zombies. I don't know what they are. It wasn't a it was a rhetorical question. Yeah. Or well, it wasn't a question that I could. Can I ask a question? Zach, is there something here that you want to check out? I want to go to. <laughs> Bruh. 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 <laughs> uh, I think food might be here. And if not, let's go check that out. Alright, we'll pause here then. It's dangerous to run around here, boys. Grandpa, hurry! Hurry Grandpa, up! Grandpa, you're too slow!
I wonder if the uh, the the loading screen influences uh, I think if we sleep we should probably sleep for um six hours. No, longer than that. I noticed that there were no cars um Zach, is there something here that you want to check out? We need to be at the community center by 1500 today. Just think of talking in front of all those people. What do you think, Zach? We have a full salmon in our backpack. Wow, okay. So that refills the entire, like, Any money for shaving this morning? No. <laughs> That's a sore point. Also, it's downright scary kind of looking in there because, like, there's Sky isn't really like red. Not red. So well, then, what was that event? Maybe it's like that just happens during midnight. Hey, uh, you, you gotta go inside, or else you know. Like this guy's mailbox. Uh, yeah, I'll take, <laughs> I'll, uh, take your 10 millimeter bullets. I know it's like a felony, but maybe you shouldn't be having those anyway. We just ate like a whole salmon that's been just uh... yeah. probably shouldn't try and get in here. I like how also automatically parked for us because I don't think I did that well with parking for all of like the bad ones. Always. 
still closed. Okay, it's like almost seven. Right. I mean, it's not like what's it? Well, you had seven minutes. You had seven minutes. Let's check this song, and that's kind of relieving because I've been creeping for like in this game, like staying in place the entire night. Mm -hmm. So that's kind of cool. I don't think he's in that room. I don't think he even knows. Oh, they only took like one percent damage. Zach, picking up from where we left off. Okay, Zach, I've been thinking about what movie I'd like to watch next, and finally I've made a decision. It's always hard to narrow it down just to one movie, but I've put a lot of thought into this, and I'm sure you'll agree with me. 1975, directed by Steven I Spielberg for himself, a bit, like that. the grandfather of Panic movies. Set in a small town in Massachusetts. That movie made me stay away from the beach for years. I was always afraid that a hand might come floating up. You know what I'm talking about, right? Yeah? It's Jaws. The underwater camera work, hmm? Zach, we'll finish our chat later. Let's take a walk around here. I feel downright crazy that, you know, enemies just spawn in the middle of the night when, uh... It looked like looked like a giant angel or something. Have you seen any any of the game? Like all the stuff. Like going back to the game and everything like that.
natural thing to do would be to find a place to sleep, but I guess I'll just smoke a cigarette. Dude, this smells so good. Nice. Huh. Ass carried over on this car. Looks good. Yeah, it's all right. All right, why can't I not pick you up? I picked you up earlier. What do you mean the gas transferred over? Like, it's still at, eight, it's at 87 instead of at 99. Zack, picking up from where we left off. Okay, Zack, I've been thinking about what movie I'd like to watch next. And finally, I've made a decision. It's always hard to narrow it down just to one movie. But I've put a lot of thought into this, and I'm sure you'll agree with me. 1975, directed by Steven Spielberg himself, the grandfather of panic movies. Like I can do Set in a small things. town in Massachusetts. That movie made me stay away from the beach for years. I was always afraid that a hand might come floating up. You know what I'm talking about, right? Yeah? It's Jaws. The underwater camera work accompanied by that John Williams music I'd never been that scared by a movie before. But the best thing about it is that it isn't just another panic movie. The mayor who won't close the beach even when there are so many victims. And Chief Brody putting the citizens' lives above all else. The film gave a Wait, lot of time to the dispute the friction between them. Earlier. It certainly had a lot of messages for a two-hour film. That's probably another reason why it was such a record-breaking hit. One of my regrets in life is that I didn't see it at the movie theater. I guess I was still just a child back then. But still, I wanted to taste that terror in real time. That reminds me, Zack. Did you know this one? Jaws also appears in another movie that was produced by Spielberg. The second back to the... F oh, Zack, we're here. Let's continue our chat later. No, we had to go back then. Zach, no, Emily arranged for people to come between 1500 and 1700. We can't do anything here right now. Let's come back at the right time. Another one out is the, the cigarette. Oh, <laughs> what the heck? Or we could smoke inside the house, because then they'd wake us in.
previously. <sighs> uh, it's time to get some new sticks on my thing. Huh? What, what, what? Oh, I guess it's fifteen to seventeen. Come any closer, Thomas? No. <laughs> Thomas. What? Oh, Agent York. I'm sorry. I must have just dozed off. Dozed off. Last night. Last night. Or late last night. Last night. Sorry. No. Well. At my sister's bar to help her out. So, sister's, sister's bar. Uh, 
expect to stay there, okay? Either way, that makes him an able depth to use another sword. Oh my god. And that's never going to Thomas. Oh, he's in York. Sorry, I must have dozed off. It's warm today. It's warm for most everyone. We were in a tiny place. I don't remember that. Yes. I'm really sorry. Probably get the same. Payment details. Or for cold blood. Extra for fortune telling. Extra for checking weather. Huh? Habitants claim. That's the city that's being a nuisance event. Situation? Yeah. Yeah, that, there's a fly circling around us. Okay, I, I understand now. Previously,
Zack, picking up from where we left off. Okay, Zack, I've been thinking about what movie I'd like to watch next. And finally, I've made a decision. It's always hard to narrow it down just to one movie. But I've put a lot of thought into this. And I'm sure you'll agree with me. 1975. Directed by Steven Spielberg himself. The grandfather of panic movies. Set in a small town in Massachusetts. That movie made me stay away from the beach for years. I was always afraid that a hand might come floating up. Oh, Zach, we're here. Let's continue our chat later. Zach, Emily arranged for people to come between 1500 and 1700. We can't do anything here right now. Let's come back at the right time. Having trouble with words today. <laughs> uh oh. Um, guys. Crash is there. Eh, okay. Uh, well, I guess this, this is a good point to cut it. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Sorry about all the tech issues, but yeah, it's a good time so we can do this.